Welcome to Excel Magic Trick number 1204. Hey, if you want to download this workbook and follow along, click on the link below the video. In this video, we have a column of errors, and we need an icon to show up. If we go from day one to day two, or any two days, and we go down, we want it to show an up arrow. If we go from one day to the next and the errors go up, we need a down red arrow. If there's no change, sideways yellow. Now, in order to use the icon conditional formatting, we're going to need a number in the cell to indicate the three different sets. So I'm going to choose 0, 1, and minus 1. Now, there's a couple ways we can do this. If we want this rule right here, minus 1 for green arrow, 0 for no chains, 1 for red, we could simply go, hey, I'm going to take the later day minus the earlier day. Now notice, this is going down and it's a minus. Double click and send it down. What we really want is minus 1, 0, and 1. So guess what? I'm going to steal a trick from Mr. Excel all the way back in one of our first duels six or seven years ago. Hey. We know we have positive, negative, and zero, so we simply use the sign function. The sign will give us minus one, one, and zero. Now I've edited this formula, and I have the whole column highlighted. So to populate this edited formula down, I hold Control and Enter. And there's our minus one, which should be green. So now we go up to Home, Styles, Conditional Formatting, and Icon Sets. But oops, wait a second. It's going down, no problem. We can reverse this and get rid of that number, back up to conditional formatting, and down to manage rules. And down here, we can edit. And the first thing we can do is we can reverse the icon order, and then we can show icon only. And when I click OK, click OK, we have exactly what we want. Now, if we were thinking more clearly from the outset, we simply could have done, hey, sign and give me the first one minus the second one. Control Enter, double click and send it down. Alt H L and I'm gonna down arrow to the icons, right arrow and enter. And there we go. Oops, Alt O D. I forgot we have to edit the rule and say show icon only. Click OK, click OK. So thanks to Mr. Excel for that amazing sign to get icons to indicate down, up, and no change. All right, we'll see you next video.